Turn your dream of an adventurous trip to famous landmarks into reality. So, what are you waiting for? Grab your bag and march towards the untold path that helps you open gates of opportunity and fill your life with enthusiasm and curiosity. There are several monuments including cultural heritage, historical, architectural, or technical, political, and many more. So in this video, we are going to show you the world's top 10 most iconic landmarks to visit. The video is going to be amazing, so make sure you stick to the end. Number 10. Statue of Liberty USA One of the most iconic structures of the United States of America without a doubt is the Statue of Liberty. Also known as Lady Liberty, the Statue of Liberty was a gift from the people of France to the United States and symbolizes the Roman goddess of freedom Libertas wearing a robe whose one hand bears a torch and the other bears a tabula ansata, which means a tablet evoking the law. The UNESCO Statement of Significance describes the statue as a masterpiece of the human spirit that endures as a highly potent symbol, inspiring contemplation, debate, and protest of ideals such as liberty, peace, human rights, abolition of slavery, democracy, and opportunity. Plan to visit the Statue of Liberty between April and June or September and October for beautiful weather and thinner crowds. Purchase your ticket for the ferry to Liberty Island in advance to avoid queues, and note that you'll need an additional ticket if you want to climb to the statue's crown. Number 9. Burj Khalifa Dubai If you thought that Burj Khalifa is only known for its extraordinary height, prepare to be even more impressed. Watching over Dubai from 828 meters, 2,716.5 feet, this tallest man-made construction on land ever built holds six more world records. The tallest elevator will take you to all floors in the building with the most floors in the world, 160 of them, where you can reside in the highest residential apartments and enjoy a meal in the highest restaurant from the ground level. After you finish dining on the 122nd floor, maybe you too will be inspired to break the record of French Spider-Man Alain Robert, who unassistedly climbed Burj Khalifa in 6 hours, 13 minutes and 55 seconds. If jumping is more your speed, Follow the steps of French jumpers Fred Fugin and Vince Graffit to find yourself on the list of highest base jumpers. Number 8. The Colosseum Rome, Italy Fancy yourself a bit of a gladiator? Well, you may have seen the epic films and think you can swing a sword, but once you're down in the arena of the Colosseum in Rome, you'll probably be so overwhelmed by the size of the amphitheater, you'll want to reconsider. The Ronas really did take their fun and games seriously. The amphitheater is large enough to have held an audience of around 80,000, which is well on par with most modern Olympic stadiums. The fantastic construction is truly mind-boggling when you consider the materials and equipment the Romans had available to build it. Even more incredible is that it's still standing today. Take an underground tour of the tunnels and feel the prickle of ghostly goosebumps crawl across your skin in sympathy for all the gladiators and animals who preceded you, but weren't fortunate enough to come out again and end their day snacking on pizza. Number 7. Stonehenge, England this prehistoric monument consists of a number of standing stones and hundreds of burial mounds. Archaeologists estimated that Stonehenge was built between 3000 BC to 2000 BC. The actual purpose and the methods used for bringing huge stones to the site still remain a mystery. Two types of stones called sarsen and blue stones are used for its construction. Sarsen stones are 25 tons in weight and 18 feet in height. Blue stones weigh up to 4 tons. Archaeologists found the closest place where these stones were found is 240 miles away from Stonehenge, but the method used by the ancient for bringing huge stones to this site is still unknown to the modern world. It took at least 15,000 years for the construction of Stonehenge. This site is also aligned with midwinter and midsummer sunsets. Today, Stonehenge is protected and managed by the National Trust and the English heritage of the country. Number 6. Golden Gate Bridge, United States of America San Francisco's iconic Golden Gate Bridge has been featured in multiple films and is practically the poster child for the Bay Area. The bright red suspension bridge was built in the early 1930s and even has a look-alike copycat, the 25 de Abril Bridge in Portugal. There's plenty of debate on where to grab the best views and snaps, though many tourists suggest that it's a bridge best experienced via biking or just plain walking across. It took four years for the construction of the Golden Gate Bridge. The international orange color was used for this bridge and about 38 painters performed regular maintenance on this bridge. The two main cables within Golden Gate Bridge were made up of 27,000 strands of wire. Today, more than 40 million vehicles pass between this bridge every year and remain one of the most photographed bridges in the world. Before we move on, support us by hitting subscribe and the bell icon to get notified when we post new videos. Now let's get back to our topic. Number 5. Sydney Opera House, Australia Sydney Opera House is the most recognizable icon of Australia, 
Located in Bennelong Point of Sydney Harbour, Sydney Opera House hosts more than 1,500 performances every year, one of the busiest art centers in the world. This art center includes a concert hall with 2,700 seating, a drama theater, a playhouse, a forecourt, and a studio. It is estimated that over 7 million people visited this site every year, also listed on UNESCO's World Heritage Sites. As it is situated within the focal point of Sydney, near to harbour, it can be viewed from all directions and became one of the main attractions of Australia. It took 15 years for the construction of the Sydney Opera House, which started in 1957 and was completed whole works in 1973. It was designed by Danish architect Jorn Utzon. The white roof shell-shaped sails design of the site make it an architectural icon of the country. Number 4. Taj Mahal, India Located in Agra City, the Taj Mahal is the most famous landmark in India and your trip will be incomplete without visiting it. Constructed by Emperor Shah Jahan between 1631 to 1648 to commemorate and house the tomb of his beloved wife, Mumtaz Mahal, the Taj Mahal is not only a symbol of India's rich history, but also the unofficial icon of the country attracting millions of tourists from all corners of the world. The Taj Mahal is not only one of the seven wonders of the world, but has also been a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 1983. This mausoleum built with white marble is a jewel of Muslim art whose striking beauty will leave you in awe. And besides the architectural beauty, the Taj Mahal also offers some of the best sunrise views. Number 3. Disappearing Door of the Pyramid of Giza We can't talk about famous landmarks without visiting this wonder of the world. Did you know that this pyramid is one of three to have a swivel door? Even though the door weighed around 20 tons, it was easy to maneuver from the inside. That was also the only way to open it, and it blended so perfectly into the structure of the pyramid that it wasn't noticeable from the outside. After hearing this fact, we get why people think that the aliens built the pyramids, but the credit goes to very talented masons, architects, and engineers of that time. Around 30,000 of them, to be precise, if the estimates are to be believed. As the site of the pyramid is located just outside the center of Cairo, you'll get a nice blend of landscapes when visiting. Number 2. The London Eye The London Eye is one of the most iconic landmarks in the United Kingdom. It is a bronze observation wheel that sits on the River Thames in London. The attraction opened to the public in 2000 and has since become an international tourist attraction. The London Eye is 179 meters high and has a diameter of 394 meters. It takes about 20 minutes to cycle around the wheel. The ride offers panoramic views of London as you ride around. The London Eye has been awarded 5 stars by TripAdvisor, which means that it is ranked among the best attractions in the world. It is also one of only 6 attractions in the world to receive 5 stars from both UK Travel Association and Lonely Planet. Number 1. Eiffel Tower, Paris A beacon over the City of Lights, the 1,063-foot-high Eiffel Tower, soaring over the southwest side of the city, from its base in the 7th arrondissement, has become a symbol synonymous and not just with Paris, but France as a whole. Conceptualized by French engineer Gustave Eiffel as a temporary yet revolutionary structure for the 1889 World's Fair, it's hard to imagine that the open lattice wrought iron tower was destined to be demolished after just 20 years. Indeed, the tower's unusual aesthetic was a matter of great public controversy, but ultimately, it was spared from demolition, thanks largely to its utilitarian potential as a telecommunications tower. Today, the city's signature spire is a firm fixture on the Parisian cityscape, marking one of the most famous landmarks in Europe and the world. So that's it. Please like, share, and comment your thoughts below if you liked this video. Remember to subscribe to see our next video. Stay safe, and we will be back soon with another video.